is KOB4 Nightbeat. And good evening, New Mexico. Tonight, an Albuquerque family is upset at the latest turn in the case of their son, who was shot and killed two and a half years ago. This Crime Stoppers bulletin went out today. Albuquerque police say they want to find 21 year old Ariana Hawkins, and they're looking for your help. She's facing charges in the death of Ryan Saavedra Jr. Police say he was killed in an attempted robbery. Police also say Hawkins ditched her ankle monitor. Pre-trial detention services reps told a judge it was last turned on a month ago. It ran out of battery late on a Saturday night. They say they called Hawkins and she said she couldn't find the charger. Her charges in Saavedra's case include attempted armed robbery. Tommy Lopez explains the case against all five suspects and what the victim's parents say justice would look like. This is all I have left to run. Ryan Saavedra Sr. says this is all he has left of his son. I keep a candle lit for him every day and I say prayers for him every day. He and his wife Danielle put that candle on the table for dinner every night. Ryan Saavedra Jr. was 18 when he was shot and killed in April of 2021. Just a giant wound that's open, bleeding. They say the world lost a great person. Beautiful person, beautiful smile. He was always trying to help people. He was very bright, had a very good work ethic. He was two weeks away from graduating high school, and they were proud of him. Without him, it's torn our family apart. Saavedra is one of the many young people who have been shot and killed in Albuquerque. Police say the five suspects were all in a vehicle, and one of them told police everyone in the car indicated they wanted to take fentanyl pills that day, but had little money. Whoever they were going to meet, they were going to rob them of their drugs. The woman who's now wanted, Ariana Hawkins, she was 19 at the time. Police say she messaged Saavedra and set up a drug deal. At the meetup, while Saavedra was still in his car, police say 18-year-old Ahole Guzman pepper sprayed him, and then 20-year-old Dominic Mullen, whose nickname is Cash, shot him. Court records show all five suspects have, or at one point had, plea deals in the works. Only one has learned their sentence. The driver of the vehicle got 12 years. Saavedra's parents are upset, angry at the criminal justice system. It feels like we're the ones with the life sentence. They're frustrated Hawkins has broken free of her ankle monitor. Shocking. Very shocking. Very shocking. And they believe all five should be locked up for a long time. Does this feel like you're getting justice? Not really. Not justice in our eyes. Though nothing will bring their son back. This is something we have to live with for the rest of our lives. And Tommy joins us now. So, Tommy, when are we going to learn the accused gunman's punishment in this? We expect to learn that at a plea hearing for him that is set for later this month, October okay. 17th. And I asked the Saavedras, what would they want to see as far as changes in Albuquerque? Mm -hmm. They said they would like to see more gun education in mm. schools, maybe as early as sixth grade. They figure teach kids about the dangers of even being around guns. Do it at an early age yeah. because we know so many of them will experience gun violence in their lives. Yeah, and we're seeing 13, 14 year olds charged in, in gun related cases. So we got to get to yeah. them younger. Okay, Tommy, thanks for sharing their story.